Hello. Oh gosh, don't I sound awful? Well, I'm not looking particularly cute right now. And I was just lying in bed, coughing up a lung and thinking that I sound like Phoebe in that episode where she catches a cold and she thinks that she's so sexy. And so like she wants to have a cold all the time because she sounds amazing when she sings. Um, but yeah, my body and my immune system hates me right now. And I am, I've got the flu. I, I think it's the flu. There's something going on in my chest as well. Um, and I have a call with the doctor for a telehealth consult, but real life. Um, I thought I'd take this opportunity because you know, I'm not gonna, I'm not the sort to just make a video for, for, to make a video. But this seems opportune because I am sick and I need to get a tall. Hang on. And when I'm sick and <laughs> sick and lazy, okay, um, sometimes I just, don't want to do much and you know a lot of skincare information that you watch read hear etc they talk a lot about <coughs> um just doing the bare minimum and in reality most people will tell you dermatologists, skincare enthusiasts, and things like that will tell you all you really need is to cleanse, tone, and moisturize, and then sunscreen in the daytime. Um, and, you know, obviously, if you've seen any of my old or previous skincare routines, I do a lot of stuff when I have the energy and when I feel like it. And it does work for me. And I, I'm older, I have mature skin. So sometimes, you know, when you're older, you need a bit more help or extra help. <coughs> but then there are days like today, and this is gonna be like today, probably for the next week until I get over this dreaded flu. Um, Cause I really only felt sick of, a day or two ago and it like today is kind of the day where it's gotten really bad and I know I'm sick and I've got this horrible chest infection um but I had to go out today and I have a full face of makeup on and there have been times look I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you and there have been times when I'm just like not even taken off my makeup and gone to bed. And there have been times when I have not bothered at all with anything. And um, not too long ago, I think I probably went like three or four days, <laughs> honestly, without washing my face and just using some micellar water and this Darba first spray. That's why there's hardly any, any of it left first spray serum and that's all I've done is I've just wiped my face with the micellar water and then doused myself in this and just sprayed a lot of it and, and called it a day uh, and that was all I did for like you know several days once a day um I was quite ill a while ago which is why I'm saying my my body hates me and my immune system is absolutely shot right now um, but you can only do so long, do that for so long with your skin before it starts to get very unhappy with you. And mine kind of got to that point where I started breaking out a little bit. And I thought, oh, I better do something. But anyway, today I have a full face of makeup on. It's still mostly there. Um... There's still a little bit of blush going and the eyeshadow is still looking pretty decent considering I think it's been more than 12 hours. But so all I'm really doing is I'm removing my makeup. I am using this Soft Mio Deep Cleansing Oil. This stuff is amazing. Um, 
I, I'm not, I've always not really seen the hype or seen the point of a cleansing oil or all I did was pump it and then uh, rub it around in my hands a little bit and I'm just applying it on my face of the cleansing oil. I mean, <coughs> I see the point of uh, double cleansing if you're wearing a lot of makeup. And I don't always wear a lot of makeup. Um, and even sometimes on my makeup days, it can be pretty light. But I've never really liked cleansing bulbs and cleansing oils because a lot of times they leave a film over my eyeballs and everything gets all funky and horrible. But... So I've just wet my hands a little bit because this emulsifies. And I have heard people say that with this, it's good enough that I don't actually need to um, do a second cleanse if I'm really wanting to be lazy. But I'll try not to be incredibly lazy tonight. And do a little bit more, which basically means I'll do my proper double cleanse. So, which is the cleansing oil, this cleansing oil. It's taken me a long time to get to the point where I've used up a whole bunch of other stuff that I can use this. And I have to say, I really like this cleansing oil. It's so nice. My skin feels amazing after using it. Um, I'll show it to you again. It's the soft meal and it's the deep. There's a pink version. I think that's a quite popular, a light one, but I don't have this, that one. I got that from my local Korean Asian grocery store. Um, and like, wow, I really like it. And my eyeballs don't end up feeling funky. Um, and they don't leave a, a film of oil or balm over my eyes. So I don't feel like, um, you know, it's not greasy. And my skin feels really hydrated and soft and smooth after I remove it, which I really like. Um, I just have water in my sink, which is sort of down here um that you can't see <laughs> and I, I just use a washcloth i'm not about the water splashing life that's just way too way too much mess for me and um yeah so my skin always feels really soft really clean when I'm done, and, and if I really wanted to, I could leave it at this, but I generally do do a double or a second cleanse just to make sure I've got everything off and things like that at the moment. Um, oh, I'm pretty far down on this one now. I'm not a fussy cleanser. My skin is not really very, very sensitive, so I don't need very particular cleansers. I can pretty much use anything as long as it's not too stripping or drying. So at the moment, I'm using the Neutrogena Deep Clean Hydrating Foaming Cleanser. I do like the foaming cleanser. And I guess that's kind of like an old school thing for me because I like, I like to see the foam. It kind of makes me feel like I'm actually cleaning my face. I'm using my electric silicon facial cleansing brush, which I really like. I use it on a low setting. Oh, dang it. What's going on? It's not coming on. Oh, oops. <laughs> oh, there it is. It's working. It took a little while. I think it needs to be charged. So, and all I do is a little water. Again, I'm not 
you know, splashy water around or anything like that. And I, I try not to be too messy because I don't like having to clean up. And then I just dip it back in the water that I've got going on in the sink just to make sure that I, you know, get it to lather up a bit more. I love this. I love this um, cleansing brush. The silicone bristles are really, really gentle. They stay really clean. They don't get like, you know, icky. I can wash it and it cleans well. I've never had an issue with it and it was fairly inexpensive. I don't, know. I don't remember exactly what I paid for it, but it might have been about $15. There's one from Kmart. I gave that to my mom. Um, I, I wanted this one because this is USB rechargeable. I gave the battery one for, to my mom, but I kid you not, the, the one I gave my mom, I think it used like one single AA battery. <laughs> and that thing lasts like months on that one battery. So that works really, really well too. But I, I really preferred and, and wanted a rechargeable one. So that's kind of what I ended up getting. And I like this one because, it, well, I, I like any of these types of silicon brushes because it's a little bit of massaging as well as some, you know, really good cleansing. And, um, and that's all I do, just give it a really good cleanse. I really need to blow my nose. It's getting a bit cloggy, but um, I'm almost done <laughs> because uh, when I do like basic, basic skincare, you know, we go back to the cleanse and I know I did an extra step because I had makeup on tonight. So I did a double cleanse. Um, you know, all I'm doing is cleansing toner and moisturizer and that's it. I'm gonna call it a night because your girl is just tired and the flu when you have a compromised immune system is no joke. So hopefully the call with the doctor will help tomorrow. He'll give me some of the good meds that'll deal with predominantly the chest infection um which usually is is my issue whenever i i get the flu is if it gets into my chest and recently it's been getting into my chest a lot and also because there's like some kind of a weird bug going around that's that's causing bronchitis and pneumonia and and getting into the chest um, that's a real issue. And it, it's, it's horrible because it feels like something's sitting on my chest and everything feels really tight and constricted and, oh, that, I wet my shirt. Um, and it makes it really hard to breathe. So, um, it's not been, it's not been a fun few days, but I have a tiny little bit of energy today because I took a nap. Uh, and I'm going to try to get to bed early tonight, despite the insomnia and the menopause and things like that. So I think that will help because, you know, when you're not well, the best thing you can do for yourself is to rest and, and sleep as much as you can to recover. <coughs> if you heard that, that was the sink. Uh, and the water draining. I, maybe I should have left it. And so you didn't have to listen to all the weird sucky sounds. Um, just getting my little duck towel. Is it, is it a duck or a goose? I don't really know. Um, it's a hand towel. It's a microfiber towel. It's cute. I like that it's got a little doohickey so I can hang it. And I have it hanging on the side of my vanity. Um, and so... On the skincare front, when I'm feeling this, like, low-key, I'm not feeling lazy, okay? Uh, like, you, I can do this when I'm lazy, too, which is fine.
But when I'm feeling really low key and I just don't want to do a lot because I don't feel great, um, I'm using my AHA, BHA, PHA 30 Days Miracle Toner. This is from Some By Me. I'm still using it. I have about that much left. It's a bit hard to see because, you know, a lot of the bottle is, oh, I'm up to about here. So I'm getting there. And, and you see, the thing is, I've just used the oil cleanser and then I've just used the hydrating cleanser. And I think part of it is because it's hydrating. My skin still feels really soft and really nice and it doesn't feel tight. You know the feeling I'm talking about, right? When when you you use a cleanser and your skin ends up feeling really tight and, and like just... It doesn't feel that way. So all I'm using is some toner and then a moisturizer. That's all I am doing. I'm, I'm, I'm going right back to the basics. Um, mostly because of energy or the lack thereof and motivation but because I had makeup on today I couldn't just like wipe with the micellar water well I could have but it wouldn't have been very good um so it wasn't just the micellar water and for moisturizer actually I am using this Muji moisturizing cream it's 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 very no fills packaging it's 50 mils it wasn't terribly expensive um, I bought it when I when I bought the the all-in-one serum, and if you've watched my skincare, the the glowing simple skincare glowing something I forget the exact title, but it's sort of like my quick and easy skincare for lazy days. Um, I I I showed this uh, and. and and I have to say, I really like the Muji line and the Muji skincare of the little that I've tried. And all I've really tried is the moisturizing cream and the all-in-one serum. And, and both of them I have really liked and I really enjoy. Um, the all-in-one serum I don't use all the time. But this Muji moisturizing cream, it's just a basic cream that's got ceramides and it's basically just very moisturizing um i like it i like it a lot i usually tend to be a little bit more diligent about you know not sticking my fingers into things but i've been in a bit of a i just want to stick my fingers into everything mood <laughs> but my hands are clean and it's just me using it and for the most part, most things that come in a pot are formulated in such a way that it can handle you sticking your finger into it for a short period of time. And anyway, that's all I'm doing. Uh, cleanse, tone, and moisturize. And, and I have to admit that because of the moisturizer that I'm using, and I'm not saying you need to use the, the Muji, right? And I'm not saying you need to use the same toner or anything like that. All I'm saying is, if all you're doing is just the bare minimum, cleanse, tone, moisturize at night, cleanse, tone, moisturize, and sunscreen, or if you have a two-in-one moisturizing sunscreen, cleanse, tone, and sunscreen for the daytime. That's all you need to do. And... Because I'm being lazy and minimal, I'm just going to just run gently, very, very gently. So don't any of you come at me about not being gentle with my eyeballs. Um, whatever's left on my eyelids, which is very, very moisturizing. And, 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 and this moisturizing cream is beautiful. It feels really nice. I wake up and my skin's feeling very soft and very supple and things like that. And I probably should have been a little bit more prepared, which, you know, I'm not. Um, and had my iPad so that I could read all the ingredients because it's all in Japanese. So I would have had to, like, look it up 
get it translated and then looked up what each ingredient was and etc cetera, etc cetera. but i'm just gonna link to the product down below so if you want to look it up you can look it up but you know i'm not here to recommend a product or anything like that i'm just kind of like <clears throat> was in the mood to <coughs> film a video to show what I do when I am just like stripping it right back to the bare bones. I mean, in reality, if I wanted to really show what I do when I've stripped it right, right back to the bare bones is basically all I'm doing is my cellar water and the spray. Um, like I said earlier, and I kind of did that for a while. Uh, but the thing is when you're my age, okay, and I'm not talking about somebody who's young, who's got good skin, and, and you know, if you're in your teens or your 20s or whatever. Um, after a few weeks of that kind of a very minimal effort treatment on the skin, my skin will start to revolt and get unhappy with me. Um, but when i'm not well and i just do like the bare minimum with the toner and the moisturizer i can get away with it for about a week or so um before my skin says to me hey you know you need to get back on the retinol or the tre tretinoin or the vitamin c or whatever it is or whatever actives it is that that to just you know kind of boost back the skin um health Sorry, the words were just escaping me. So yeah, that's kind of it. I am gonna go to sleep now, actually. I'm gonna brush my teeth next, a little bit of lip balm, take my meds, that kind of stuff. And then I'm gonna call it a night. So yeah, thank you for watching. I will catch you hopefully next time when I'm feeling a little bit better and hopefully after the doctor's consult tomorrow, he'll give me some of the good stuff and I can recover a lot quicker. Bye-bye.